this year we celebrate modern culture and tourism. We celebrate 50th anniversary of our modern relations. Spain and China have been in contact for many centuries. The first uh, translation of a Chinese Confucian classical text to an European language was into Spanish in the 16th century. And uh, Spanish priests wrote books about China which were translated to all European languages. So since then, we had a very intense a trade exchange. There is a, an urgency and also a huge desire from both sides to, you know, to talk to one another. We really need, as you say, to start again human, human contacts, person-to-person -person contacts in all fields. In culture, like we are trying to do now, in education by bringing back our professors of Spanish language and our students to China. And also, of course, having Chinese students and Chinese professors of Chinese, which is also very much in demand. We have to, to increase those, uh, those contacts and to have more people coming. This is going slow, m slower than we would like, mm -hmm. but it is important to push it forward. It is not only that, it is journalists, it is think tanks, it is businessmen, of course. Mm -hmm. Our societies have to start mixing again to start uh, getting to, to know each other again and to understand what has happened in, ha happened in the last few years because many things have changed. Yeah. How is this relearning process for you so far, Mr. Ambassador? I think culture is the best bridge to find understanding. So we, if we bring our, our museums to China, we're very really happy to bring this major exhibition of Dali to, to Guiyang because for them it was, of course, something very is special uh, and for us it was important to bring this exhibition outside of the big cities. In Wuyang I learned that China is a country of diversity with many minorities uh, which have a strong voice also in the life of the country. I learned that you have there one of the most important telescopes in the world, very important for the space uh, uh, sciences mm -hmm. and China has made in, in in, in very important strides forward in its space exploration, so Wu Yang is playing a role there. I learned that um, in spite of the difficult uh, climate uh, conditions, natural conditions, Harbin and uh, Helgolian is a province with an incredible agricultural wealth, with great potential also for renewable energies, mm. with very new um, high-tech industries. Some of them, by the way, with a Spanish presence, like Airbus, because Air Spain is one of the three founding countries of Airbus. Mm -hmm. uh, but also automobile parts, we also have some, some companies there.